All right, ladies and gents, we're going back to back on videos here. And like I said, today I'm having one of those days. So I went to Target on my lunch break and we bought two of these Pokemon Stellar Crown um, booster packs. Mostly because I'm not eating lunch today and I'm like, okay, I guess I can afford it. But also these illustration rares look cool, but also I'm kind of having one of those days. And I think this will just, you know, give me a, Give me a little bit of retail therapy to get through the rest of the day. So um, we're going to start off with the first pack here. No reason to uh, to lengthen these things out. Um, I do not know what the trick is whatsoever. So I'm just going to be pulling it the way it is. Um, and on top of that, what I am interested in is the illustration rares. because I think they look cool. Um, but other than that, I'm kind of out of the loop on everything revolving Pokemon cards at this point in time. So even seeing this uh, silver bordering is kind of messing with my head a little bit. But all right, so the first card we got, Salandit, Diplin, Panseer, Metadite, Salazzle, Driftblim, Papaya Berry. Our reverse hollow is a Ledian. I guess you get another type of reverse here, which is our Morgrim. And then our hollow here is an Archaludon. Basic energy, psychic energy. And then I will not be doing any Pokemon.com interesting stuff. So if anybody would like this card code, there you go. All right, nothing crazy there, nothing interesting really. I guess I didn't know that you would get two reverse hollows, but that's interesting. Kind of fun that I got Salandit and Salazzle in the same one. But um, Driftblim actually reminds me, there was one time when I was a kid, I had won some cards from a Pokemon League tournament and I opened a card that was like a shiny uh, Drift Balloon. I wish I would have kept that. But let's keep moving. We got another pack here. Uh, I probably only have like five minutes left before I have to drive back to work. So let's uh, see if we can't open this up. The other thing I noticed with card packs these days is like literally the whole thing with opening them is you're trying to open them as delicately as possible to an extent. And they're impossible to open. But maybe I'm just too worried about it. Maybe if I was opening a whole booster box, I would feel a little bit different. But who knows? All right. So first card we got here, Turtoga. Meltan. Fletchinder. Finneon. Togemaru. He's kind of cute. Belusa, Tornadus. I remember, uh, y'all remember Landorus Therian in uh, Wi Fi Battles circa Gen 5? Me too. All right, next card here Lilip, Reverse Hollow. Actually, looks kind of cool. I like, I like that Pokemon still does decent art design. I think sometimes it's not as good, but ooh, baby. Vickavolt. And then out of our two packs, we actually did get an EX. So Lapras EX. Thank you for joining, uh, joining the fam here. I'm not sure if there's anything special about this other than it's a Lapras EX. It says secret rare. Looks pretty cool. Um, I'll be obviously looking up whatever the value is of this later on. I don't really care if I'm going to do anything with it. It'll be to slab it just for fun. But um, And then we get a basic energy here. Fire. And then here's the code card for anybody that is interested in that. Okay. So today we opened two card packs. And we did get an EX. So I'm not sure if that's a good pull or bad pull or whatever, but uh, you know, I'm pretty sure 
we got our uh, Lapras out of the non-Lapras blister. So, isn't that interesting? Regardless, um, none of that stuff actually matters, I bet. But um, regardless, that's the video. We opened two card packs. I actually ended up getting something. So, there you go. I got to drive back to work. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Comment down below if you guys are enjoying these random-ass videos.